the point of everything we're doing is building a shape as a container to release into. Mm -hmm. If you release without releasing into something, you have no way of using the, the material, right? So everything we're doing is about creating a shape that has structure and integrity, but is balanced and relaxed so you can control the rising and falling of the wave through the shape. Mm -hmm. um, so again, if you push on me, you build up a good pressure and release whenever you want. See the force in, really push, give me some. What do you feel? Well, I feel the ground. <laughs> I feel going into the ground, I feel your tissues compress, and then I feel them release, but it's not like you're trying to project me, you're just the tissues are released. Right, there's no, the vertical alignment doesn't get swayed. Yeah. So the art or the skill is that any time you put force on me, I can absorb it systemically. I don't let the pressure build up anywhere. So then as you continue to come and it builds up, I just transform it. But that only works if you feel this to be real. Yeah. Because if you don't, you're not going to deal with it. But here, it, you have to, so you push harder. Yeah. And, and so all, in a sense, we're just looking to move so that we move through space in the wave that either falls or rises. And anywhere we get stuck, we can stop adjust, move through, and find a way to keep going through softness, through, through falling almost, you know? Like, so, you know, even this, right? Push. Because there's force that builds up. Yeah. The more you push into this, the more you load it up. And then, because I'm not having to address it, I'm simply eating it. Yeah turning it into the ground, I can do what I want with that build up of charge. So you make a shape, you get it strong, and then your body can release through it because the way it works is the front of the body flexes, the back extends. The back of the body goes into flexion, the front extends. But we're designed to go this way, <laughs> not this way. So we're always trying to use this open, closed wave dynamic in everything we do so that we're following the larger movement of heaven and earth. And the wave, whatever it hits, just like a water wave, can break around, change, transform. So we're keeping our own central equilibrium, using our shapes to create outcomes, not through power, but through the power of the shape itself. It's already strong. And it's strong because it's it's full and connected. My, it's right there. I don't have to wind it up. It's already at its potential energy. Um, yeah. So martial arts is a practice to change your body through practices that are specific, and you then have to change. If you get to do it the way you want to do it, nothing changes. You're just doing something different the way you do everything else. So the requirements are really important and you have to really take the time to make sure that you're finding everything you're looking for. What's, uh, is my heel in my hip? Is my hip under my shoulder? Am I finding those lines? It can't just be, you know? So.